Hey everyone, so as you can see I am still in hospital. I still have my band and my IV and whatnot. Um, hopefully I won't be here too much longer, but I had a couple of updates this morning that I wanted to update you guys on. Um, but first of all I wanted to say thank you so much for all of the love and support that I have received over the last few days. It really means a lot to me and it keeps me going. I've got Molly here with me. Um, they allowed me to keep her here with me. They moved me to a private room um, where they brought me a cot, which you can see there. They brought me a cot and I'm allowed to have her here with me. Um, they did say that the painkillers that I was being given were safe. Um, I have a very chatty girl right now. <laughs> um, they did say that they were safe for Molly, but... I breastfed her this morning and she got a really really sore tummy so as much as they're safe I don't think her tummy reacts very well with them so unfortunately I am back on pumping every couple of hours and feeding her formula which sucks but there's no point in getting upset about something that I can't change so um, that's pretty much all I need to update on about her Mason is still at my mum's house. He's having a wonderful time with my mum's best friend's kids. Um, he's made really good friends with her children, so he's having fun at their house today. He will be coming back tonight, hopefully, and then he'll be home with Daddy until the end of the week, and then I think mum's going to come over again and look after him. Because um, he's, he's booked in for daycare. <coughs> Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. It's Monday right now. Um, I'll upload this straight away. So yeah, it's Monday right now anyway. Um, I have Katrina coming to visit me soon. I did have a visit from the surgeon this morning and basically he said that they're just going to keep doing what they're doing. My blood tests have improved um, and hopefully by the by Wednesday we should have some more information on how my pancreas is doing. Um, I keep forgetting what I've mentioned and what I haven't mentioned but the last update you got was an ED. So I am in the surgical ward. I have pancreatitis um, and basically they can't do anything to my gallbladder until my pancreatitis has healed. Um, and there isn't really anything they can do for that. Basically, all they can do is just keep giving me painkillers, keep me on bed rest, and hope that it fixes itself with a strict diet. Um, and then once everything's all healed and I'm all better, they will take my gallbladder out before they discharge me so that hopefully I will have no more issues. Um... But yeah, the surgeon came around this morning, said my blood tests and everything were improving a lot. So that's promising. Um, last night was a bit of a worry. My blood sugar levels, um, those who don't know what the pancreas does, I'm pretty sure it regulates the blood sugar levels and all that sort of stuff. It does the blood sugar side of things. And my blood sugar le levels were really low last night and I started getting extremely cold chills. My lips and my hands were blue. Um, I was shivering, I had like three or four layers on and I was under a blanket and I was still freezing and shivering. Um, so they had to give me like three of these sugar drink things to bring my blood sugar back up um, and forced me to eat my dinner, which at the time I was not hungry at all so I felt like a ginormous bloated mess when I'd finished. Um, which was... <laughs> Not a nice feeling. Um, with the pancreatitis, I feel like I am just full and bloated all the time. And then being forced to eat a full meal as well, it was just double bloating. Like my stomach is so bloated. I look like I'm eight months pregnant again. Um, so that's not very good. But other than all of that, I've got my room kind of set up nicely. I've got Molly's mobile up there to so she can play under it because we didn't bring her play mat. 
um, and then her blankets and everything are just there. Her push chair and her nappy bag are just over there and then I've got a couple of chairs. Of course I have my laptop. There's Molly. Who is tired and needs to go to bed. Um, and then over here I've got all of her bottle making stuff. I've got a bottle warmer. <laughs> bottle warmer just there. And then... In this cupboard here, I have all of her sterilized water and formula. Those who care to know what formula she's on, she is on the Caracare Apatamil Gold Plus HA, um, which is inspired by breast milk. It's supposed to be broken down a lot more and is the most accurate they could get to breast milk, apparently. Um, so that's the one that she's on. And then in this drawer here, I have some fruit, I have her bottles, the pump teat, I also have some sterilizing solution, and her gripe water, and I think that's about it. And then over here is the hospital breast pump, which is way better than mine, so I'm using theirs instead. Um, so there's like a little mini room tour that's really all is in here. Um, and then over there is my own toilet and shower. And I've got a cupboard over here and I think something's in it but I'm not sure. I can't get into it because of the cot. But um, I really think that's all I needed to update on. That's how things are going at the moment. I can't wait to see Katrina. I've missed her and she keeps messaging me and she's like, I I hate that you're in hospital and I hate that you're in so much pain. Just get better already. Um, I've been getting some awesome support from the girls on my Facebook page. I'll leave the link to that below. I've been updating on there a lot and I update on Twitter a little bit as well. Also my Instagram. I've been updating my Facebook a lot more. Um, I'm a lot, um, a lot more readily available on my Miss Christy Facebook page now. Um, I'm getting the hang of using a proper page rather than Twitter or, um, getting everything to share to it rather than posting on it myself. Um, so if you want to go and talk to me on there, I will leave the link below. Um, but I think that is it. So I will love and leave you and I will update when I know more. Love you all. Bye.